18 beds at the Phoenix Society in Surrey and six at the Covenant House in Vancouver. The new beds in Surrey will serve men from throughout the province between the ages of 17 and 24, while the six beds in Vancouver are open to young adults ages 16 to 24. A welcome addition, but some advocates say young women need more help too. Difficult to be in that environment as a woman. Um, so more, I think there's such a need for, for women only places that, that can just allow women to feel safe and secure no matter what's going on in their, their life. Diversity, an organization in Surrey that provides support to marginalized communities, is concerned that these groups are being left out for um, uh, racialized communities that within their culture, like seeking even mental health services is not very common in, in their home country or not accessible in their home country. And so they come here and people talk about accessing mental health services, but then there's there's gateway, there's gates that prevent them from being able to do that. Terrell adds that marginalized groups have unique needs and are often unable to seek supports because of that. If English is not their first language and they go to a hospital seeking advice, but they can't speak English and can't communicate properly or can't advocate on their behalf, then how are they able to access um, the services that they require to be able to get help for substance use. Guy Felicella, who works with the BC Centre of Substance Use, says youth also need more support after treatment. The continuum to, to, to move them forward. And you'd like to see some additional stuff being added in as well with employment opportunities as well for youth or for anybody going into treatment because that provides purpose for people. Vancouver Coastal Health is accepting referrals from health care providers for the new beds. Services will begin by the end of June. Yasmin Gantam, CBC News, Vancouver.